प्लेग डिटेक्शन Let's see how the SNL tool identifies leak sources down the hole. Let's consider a case with four pipelines and three barriers in the upper section. This well was found to have sustained pressure in the sea annulus between 13 and 3 8 inch and 18 and 5 8 inch casing pipes. Sustained annulus pressure, or SAP, means that after bleeding excess pressure at the surface, the annulus pressure gradually recovers after closing. This means that the annulus is not sealed and communicates with a gas or fluid source somewhere down the hole. The key objective of the survey is to locate this leak by running the tool through the main 9 and 5 8 inch liner. In this case, the pressure of the sea annulus filled with gas is 670 psi, and we need to find a leak where the gas entered the annulus. First, we shut in the annulus and record background noise. The tool is run down to a reference depth and then it starts to measure noise at stations on its way up. The annulus pressure stays at 670 psi. Here is a noise spectrum for shutting conditions. The shutting SNL panel indicated no noise. The next step is to start bleeding off the C annulus pressure. The tool is run down to a reference depth and starts measuring noise at stations on its way up under bleeding conditions. We can see that pressure rapidly decreased from 670 psi to 50 psi within 6 hours. The noise spectrum now has a new component that was absent under shutting conditions. This broadband noise clearly indicates a leak. There is also some low frequency noise generated by gas flowing through fractures in the cement sheath. Once a leak has been located, a remedial job has been performed. The leak zone has been perforated and cement has been squeezed. This job was successful and eliminated sustained annulus pressure. Thank you for your time. 